What if I told you a Kentucky high school football team finished the season undefeated, yet failed to make the postseason? What if I told you the same school won 14 consecutive district games over back-to-back seasons and both times failed to reach the playoffs? This happened here in the mountains nearly 40 years ago, and the sting of being denied the opportunity to prove themselves still burns today. Yet the situation in this story changed how the Kentucky High School football playoffs are conducted. In 1977, the Wheelwright Trojans finished with an undefeated record in district play, yet at the time, only the district champion qualified for the postseason. In both 1976 and 77, that champion was the Paintsville Tigers. And in each season, neither school faced off against each other. Back in 1977, we was 7-0, and we played everybody in our district at the time except Paintsville. Paintsville played four teams in our district. They were 4-0. But they played teams outside of our district that had winning records, and we played Greenup County, Berea, and St. John Quietsburg. So we played our district games. When we played our district games, we thought that because we played more district games, which you should, that we would be counted as district champions. We won more district, won three more district games. According to a November 12, 1977 article in the Courier Journal, the lawsuit claimed that had Paintsville not been allowed to designate an out of district team as its fourth district opponent, Wheelwright would have been declared the district champions. A loophole, so to speak. Trojan head coach Don Daniels was quoted as saying, the best thing to do would be to get on the football field and find out which team is best. The Kentucky High School Athletic Association ruled that since Paintsville had opponents that their totals added up more wins than our district opponents that we beat, that they should go to the playoffs. So they ended up going to playoffs. In that process, my dad sued the Kentucky High School Athletic Association. Ultimately, the KHSAA Board of Control denied Wheelwright's appeal for a one-game playoff with Paintsville. Yet down the road, the board ruled that each football team must play every other team in its district to be eligible for the playoffs, a ruling that's still in effect today. We didn't want somebody to give us something. You know, they beat us on the field, fine. But we wanted to play that Thursday and then play the playoff game the next Monday. Yet fans and members of the 1977 Wheelwright Trojans will never know what might have been.